The ultimate aim of the project was to provide recognition to these individuals or organizations who have provided a great service uh, to Gibraltar or either to other uh, communities. So we wanted to learn about their stories and through the medium of photography we wanted to share those stories online. That's why we've published the, the photos on the Redso website which was recently launched. We've also published the photos on the Facebook page of Redso and we've encouraged everyone to have a look at them and obviously if they like the photos we'll like, we'll like them online and then provide some comments um, on the people. And there's a little bit of a write-up on each of them as well, isn't there, about uh, their contributions? That's right. It's all about their story. Um, we, we've published them there so that everyone is aware about the, the outstanding efforts that these people have done. Um, it's something that they've provided either sort of some time ago or are currently providing the local community. So it was all about this um, uh, highlighting the efforts and amazing work that the, the local people have provided. Gibraltar being such a tight-knit community, Redso being uh, a part of that community, of course, for many years. Uh, it's a quite, it's quite a nice mixture, that, to, to be able to do something for people, uh, notable people in the community. I mean, were you, did you have a hand in the selection in, in who to represent uh, Gibraltar? No, without a doubt. It's a very nice project, and I'm very glad that it's been very well received. Um, and yes, uh, we did. We were involved. I mean, Stuart, thankfully, also kept us very much up to date with regards to the selection, and we did have an input with regards to um, the selection of the heroes. No, and they can yeah. all see this on the on their website and also Facebook. Yes, that's correct. I mean, we've used social media, Facebook, Instagram, uh, Twitter, the whole lot. We've used, uh, and that can be viewed on social media on all those platforms as well as our uh, um, website.